Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will learn about the prepositions in Spanish. In In is used with locations, medium of transport and when you talk about seasons, years and months. Por ejemplo, mi casa está en el centro de la ciudad. My house is in the center of the city. Ella viaja en autobús. She travels by bus. Mi cumpleaños es en septiembre. My birthday is in September. En los inviernos a todos nos encanta tomar té. In winters we all love to have tea. They. They is used with origin or source. Basically, when you tell the origin of something from where it is originated. Por ejemplo, mi zapatos son de Italia. My shoes are from Italy. Secondly, they is used to show possession for the things you owe. And when you indicate about the matter of something. Por ejemplo, este coche es de mi hermano. This car belongs to my brother. Esta mesa es de madera. This table is of wood. Lastly, they is used when you indicate the starting point. De donde vienes? From where do you come? Con. It is usually used to indicate the presence of something or someone, whether it's a person, food or a thing. Por ejemplo, quiero jugar con ella. I want to play with her. Ella quiere ir con él al cine. She wants to go with him for movie. Sirven hamburguesas con papa fritas. They serve burgers with potatoes fries. Scene. It is the opposite of preposition con. It is used to indicate the absence of someone or something. Por ejemplo, iré a la fiesta sin Sam. I will go to the party without Sam. Ayer salí sin una paraguas. Yesterday I went outside without an umbrella. Quiere una pizza sin callos. She wants a pizza without cons. Por. Por has many uses. Firstly, it is used with movements. Like when you cross through a place to reach your final destination. Por ejemplo, ellos caminaron lentamente por el bosque para llegar a las montañas. They walked slowly through the forest to reach to the mountains. Secondly, por is used to refer the part of the day, be it afternoon, evening or morning. Por ejemplo, su madre viene por la tarde de la escuela. Her mother comes in the afternoon from the school. Then, it is used with reasons and motives. Por ejemplo, trabajo por dinero. I work for money. Now, por is also used to tell about the medium of anything. Por ejemplo, recibo la información por correo electrónico. I receive the information by email. Me gusta viajar por avión. I like to travel by aeroplane. Lastly, por is used in terms of money. Por ejemplo, compre tomates por dos euros. I bought tomatoes for two euros. Preposición para. Para is used when you address towards the destination. Por ejemplo, voy para México. I am going to Mexico. Secondly, it is used with purposes and intentions. Por ejemplo, nos vamos a Peru para ver 
Machu Picchu. We are going to Peru to see Machu Picchu. Lastly, it is used with temporary terms. Necesito el informe para el lunes. I need the report by Monday. A. A is used with time, direction and direct object pronouns. Por ejemplo, a que hora es la clase? At what time is the class? Es a la una. It is at one. Conoces a Pedro? Do you know Pedro? Voy a la clase de español. I go to the Spanish class. So friends, if you like my video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel.